Hey, Warren, a tough week last week. Um, back in training now, sun is shining, a bit more positive. How do you expect the lads to respond to what happened last week? I think you can see the sun shining because I'm looking at you with a squint here, may I? Um, no, look, it was disappointing, as I said to you, but we'll move on quite quickly. Put it to bed. Uh, everything I said at the weekend, I stand by. We were poor, but I can't knock them. They've been absolutely brilliant. It's probably... You know, the expectation levels that have jumped that quick. And it's what I said to you, we're ahead of schedule. No matter how you look at it, we have no aim this season. We just want to be competitive. It's a new team. You've seen as I keep looking at Nottingham Forest, you've seen the other night, they get hammered 4-0 by, by Leicester. It's a great result by Brendan. Um, but, you know, it, it's put to bed. You know, I, I don't dwell on it. Um, there's going to be ups and downs all season. But you've got to stay level, level-headed. level The players know that, you know, they, they were disappointed with it, but as I said to you, it's, uh, we've moved on quite quickly. You've spoken over the last few weeks about the character of these lads and what a good group they are. Um, is this a good test for that character now, for how they bounce back and, and what, you know, we, we're confident that they are a good group and then they can now show that? Yeah, well, it, it can be and it can't, no matter how you look at it. Look, at the end of the day, they're going to to win the game, we're going to to win the game. Yes, we had a disappointing result, but, you know, you can say to go on an eight game on beat and run, it's a test of character. Um, and I think they've proved that. So, no, you know, I, I think, yes, we want to go and win the game. And so do Hampton. But, you know, at the end of the day, we'll have our plan. That's one the boys want. They want to get back out on that pitch. Um, and as I say, hopefully uh, hopefully we can uh, get a result. How important is, has it been after so many Saturday, Tuesdays in a row? The games were coming thick and fast. To have a <laughs> bit of a breather this week, to get some a bit more energy in the legs. Because they were looking a bit leggy, I think it's fair to say, last no. Saturday. There may have been a reason for it. So, how, how nice has it been for them just to have... A little bit of time to reflect and to, and to rest those legs. No, definitely. Look, I, I said this, and I know from being professional all my life, and I'm not being derogatory to anyone or disrespectful, but you're you're pulling players who have been part time for most of their careers, trying to fit into the mentality and the intensity of the training that I've been used to all my life. And there's going to be a go between. And I knew this. You know, that, that's why I said we'll not probably kick in until the end of October. I said. Um, because there's going to be ups and downs. Jurgen Klopp had at Liverpool when he first went in. Players couldn't get the training methods. And I know that's going to happen here. And it's going to be inconsistent all season. I think if you look at any level of football, and especially here, you're going to have that. So it's just, you know, recharging the players. You know, obviously with the games we've had Saturday, Tuesday, it is tough. Um, but, you know, it's we've got to get on with it. I'm not making excuses. We've got to get on with it. And I think come this week, we'll give them that little couple of days as well mentally to go and... Going, I don't know what they want to do, walk their dog or whatever they want, play with their kids, but I think to get away from each other as well is very important. Um, and in the coming today, fresh, ready to go Saturday. And Hampton and Richmond, obviously, we don't like speaking too much about our opponents, as we know, but uh, an- another test back to league action, which is important as well, so no distractions to the cup anymore. <coughs> what do we expect uh, from another away game on the road? A tough game. You know, I watched them against Dartford and I thought they played very well. I thought they were very, very unlucky. Um, they've had good results, you know, a couple of boys that we had here last year, Addy and uh, Marcus, are in there. But they've got good players, you know. Um, as I said, it's going to be a difficult game because it was my first game last year down there. And uh, they're a hard, hard test. But um, it's one that, you know, we've got to be confident in and, uh, you know, hopefully have our game plan to go and uh, get the right result. Thanks, Warren. Thank you.